Hi friends, today we are going to discuss three letters mainly T, then E and M. So I'm going to make you aware about how to write these letters. So first let's talk about the small t. So the small t will go like this. T H A T. So what is happening if you observe the height of t is smaller in comparison with the height of h. At the same time the crossbar is very strong. So the height of t, this is the height of t. So if I write this is as A and this is the height of H which I will write as B. So height of A is always lesser than the height of B. Okay. Is lesser than the height of B. So while writing T H T you need to practice that. So this was the regarding the letter T. Once again, I will repeat for your confirmation. Whenever you are writing in connection, it will come like this T H A T and in terms of print writing, it will come like this T H A T. Okay, so as for your comfort, you can make the T crossbar, but whenever you are making the T crossbar, make sure that you are making it a uh, strong. It should not be exaggerated in the sense it, this is this is the wrong way of making a T crossbar. Okay, this is the wrong. This is the exaggeration. This is correct. This is correct. So this was regarding the letter T. Then we will discuss the letter E. Now the E later is for listening. So what is happening with the letter T is you need to make T letter like this. This is supposed to be open. This loop. This is a loop. This is supposed to be open. Okay. This loop is supposed to be open. If you do like this, it's a wrong way of making t this is making e wrong wrong this is a correct way this is correct way it again it should not be like this you know, this is also again wrong if it is open it has to be the connected kind of e so this is correct this is correct this is wrong so always make your e's open then there is the next letter which we want to discuss is the letter m so capital m is very strong letter in terms of making decisions strong uh, in terms of taking action so how you are supposed to write letter m so m letter you will write like this this is the way first stroke and in second and third stroke it should be complete first and the second stroke is a combination of three lines so it goes like this this also goes like this and this so one the stroke number one and this is the stroke number two so there is no third stroke in the single without lifting the pen you are supposed to complete the M. This is very, very powerful formation. So guys, uh, we have discussed three letters, mainly T, E and M. So I hope you got the, uh, it's not like that if, if I have not suggested you to write M in this way, don't practice it. If I have not suggested you to write E in that way, don't practice it. This is just to make you aware the what are the correct formation of writing these letters. Uh, it doesn't require you to practice all the letters if I have not suggested you to write any particular letter in this way you are not supposed to practice those because every letter has its own strength and weaknesses if you uh, write if you practice something which is not supposed to be practiced then you do will not get a lot of benefit in your life but if you practice the thing which I tell you okay this is the way you should write this particular letter then it will have a lot of benefit in your life so just because this is the correct way of writing M, you it doesn't mean that you should practice this. I have seen a lot of people making a lot of money, a lot of fame, a lot of recognition with this kind of M as well. So it doesn't matter what kind of uh, handwriting you have as long as you know how to use that thing for your advantage. For example, if you have a knife, so knife you can use in two different ways. One way is you are you can use that knife to kill somebody and uh, the same knife can be used to save somebody. when that knife is in hand of uh, a thief, he may kill somebody. But if that knife is in hand, or hand of uh, any surgeon, that the knife will um, save somebody. So it doesn't matter what kind of knife you have. How you use it is very important. So it is not at all um, uh, you know, suggested and required for you all to do the writing in the way I'm telling you. But th these are the correct way of making it. If at all I have suggested you, then you must practice it. 